um, I believe we've been uh, doing grades through the class as we take up this AdMob class 101. Um, today, <coughs> in this video, we're going to be um, creating a mobile application of which we we'll use to now, you know, start making money with our add more buildings that we've created in the last video. So what we're going to do is we're going to download this app for those of you who have downloaded it. If you've not, just uh, follow the link in the description. And then you're going to see this particular app in Play Store. Okay. You're going to see the app in Play Store. And you're going to download the app. You can see the features of the app. You can read through, download the app in your Play Store, and then open it. When you open the app, or oh, first thing you need to do is click on the login and sign up. And then we are going to log in. Okay, we're going to sign up. Let's go and create a new account. So I'm going to call it. Mr. Coach, okay, and I am in Nigeria, I am in Nigeria, yes, so email, I'm going to put in my email there, so I'm going to go over to my temp mail, because I have other accounts, so I'm going to just use my temp mail here to To do this, I'm going to copy this to my clipboard and open a new account. And that's it. So I'm going to save this account. Say please confirm a mail. So I'm going to go back to my email inbox. I'm going to go to my inbox and refresh and hopefully the mail is going to come in what's holding it okay, so guys i have to use another of my temp mail and uh, we have the mail here now so i'm going to confirm this Okay, now we are confirmed, so we'll go back to our application. We go back to our application, and then we're going to log in. We're going to log in. See, they have given us uh, information that our ac account has been created. So we're going to log in. So that when is the password that should be it that should be it okay so now once you log in for the first time if this is the first time you're creating your account they want immediately you log in it will take you to this very portal yeah, you can start creating your app so now remember i told you guys to do a diligent research on the kind of app you think people can can more, um, download the ones people will use i should have told you everything so let's say for example i've done my research and i want to create an app that shows people where to get virtual dollar cards and a cheap rate so i'm gonna I'm gonna title virtual dollar cards okay so i'm gonna say cheap virtual dollar cards so i'm gonna choose from gallery please do not use the option one for now that function is that uh, option is not functional for now so i'm gonna use this as my icon I'm going to give a description 
um, let access to active um, dollar virtual card providers in Africa Africa so I'm gonna hit next because that very um, problem is not just for Nigerians but for Africans so I had to use so here you can choose the your team style whatever I choose here is up to you so I just choose I'm gonna choose the blue and I'm gonna go next and then here is the basic place here you're gonna choose any of this thing any of anything you choose here determine the kind of app you're building so now I'm gonna choose the web app and since you've made your research you've gotten a link you're gonna use so personally I'm gonna use this very link and I'm gonna hit it here and I will say virtual dollar cards okay and since I have done my research I have a website URL I want to use so I'm gonna go there and copy the website URL okay I'm gonna copy the website URL that I want to use sorry not you not you history uh, okay Google so I've done my research and I had this website that is showing 13 best virtual dollar cards in Nigeria so I'm gonna copy the address and I'll go to my website and I'll paste it here okay paste it there and I hit on next and then I'll go to my app manager so the next thing I'm gonna do once you do this you've created your app okay but now we need to do a few settings to make our app look beautiful so what we're going to do now is go to this search uh, design and then you go to the menu type and you pick the sliding menu okay pick the sliding menu for this one you pick the sliding menu um, so you am going to click on save then you go to the top bar menu Okay, so we're going to remove all these things. We don't need them at the top bar. All we need is the share button and the notification button. We don't need this. We don't need this. So you just click the arrow that takes it back, takes it back, takes it back. So now we have all of the two. Um, now that's it. We're going to click on save. And then the next thing we're going to do is go to your download app. Here you see the download app. You click on download app and then you wait for a few minutes for them to create your account so you just all you need to do is copy this link okay copy this link so most times when you design the app once you get to this section the app will be available for you to download but not always so all you need to do is just copy this link this is your link then you go to your browser and paste it there okay you're gonna paste it there now our app has already been created for us so you can once you paste it you click on download so our app will be downloaded as you can see it's downloading it's downloading here for us so our app is downloading we'll wait for it to completely download and then we install now when installing sometimes play store will tell you that okay we finished downloading let's install so play store will tell you that um, the application is uh, has a virus or has a threat or something like that and you cannot be able to install it so they will ask you if you should install or not you just have to click install anyway Okay, right now I don't have space in my phone so the app cannot be installed correctly so all I need to do I'm gonna give some space in my phone and then come back and install okay so I have um, free up some spaces in my phone by deleting some applications so I'm gonna install it right now install so like I told you 
Play Store is going to give you this uh, warning. Just ignore the warning. It's because the app is currently not available on Play Store. Remember, we are going to put it on install later. So just click on install anyway. And wait for it to install. Wait for it to install. Okay, our app has got successfully been installed. So if we go over to our app, our phone. Okay, if we go over to our phone here. Sorry. So right now you can see that this is the last app I'm having here. So let's open it and see. So let's open. You can see our app is opening and it's working perfectly. So now you can see it. So send app for scanning, don't send, we don't need that. Okay, so now you can see that the app is working perfectly. We now have an app that we have converted a particular web page, the whole website to an app as it is now. So we can list this on Play Store and people can download it. Okay, now my advice for you uh, we'll discuss that in the group. We'll discuss that in the group. Uh, so if you're not on my WhatsApp group, kindly join my WhatsApp group where I give more advice and best way to get things done. Okay, so please, it is very important that you join my group as I train you on this. And for those of you who are in the group, we're going to discuss the best way to do this instead of this way. I'm going to show you the best way to do this. So as you can see that this app is working very perfectly. It's working very perfectly okay as you can see it's you can see if i minimize it you can see you can see it's a cheap virtual you can see it here cheap virtual dollar card so this is perfect we are done so uh go ahead create your app and drop it in the group let's see what you've got